the damage and we'll go put these guys back and uh, move some animals around so they're all safe. Still <laughs> Okay, so we put our um, pigs in our orchard for now. It's pretty much like our backup pen. We used to have them permanently in here, but uh, down the back there, the, the fence is real crap, and when the water's down, they can actually cross it, go around and get into the garden, but uh, at the moment, they're getting to the garden anyway. So, um, yeah, they can stay in here until I um, get them a new area to put their uh, pen up. Let's, yeah, let's see what other animals are on the escape. <laughs> so our garden wood chip is, uh, the water has rushed all through here and come all the way around here. So it's, it's all flooded all up in here, which is crazy. But uh, the pigs were over there, um, so luckily they actually escaped out of their netting. Or else they might have drowned. But yeah. And uh, our geese over here, they've gotten out because a uh, tree over here has gone over their netting. So I'm going to move them anyway. It's been two days. Two days they've lasted in here. But they're going to go up into. Um, the young goat paddock because um, time is of the essence and I don't have much time today so yeah we'll see how they're going. And this was all wood chip down here. And that's it. Okay so now to move these parts we're going to put them back up to their their old paddock up there. Done. That should be enough grass for them for a couple of days, and then left to sort out their uh, their next move. So this is the this is our um, little river down here. It's normally like a 
about a quarter of that size of water well. It's been way worse since um, in summer and stuff. Like, way worse down at me. But, um, yeah, this has basically come over the bank and flooded a bit of this. But um, down here we've got uh, this willow tree and it's pretty much come busting over from over there and created like a, a bridge. So good for the kids but uh, not so good for the fence over here. So it's another fix up I've got to do. I mean, the goats love in the tree. They're eating whatever's on it. The willow and uh, I think the widow makers. So yeah, bit of a problem into a solution there. So yeah, these things happen and uh, just gotta deal with it. Not the end of the world. It's what homesteading's all about. Yeah.